Pro no, it's a Rescorpio. It's a Goki Rescorpio. He lost. He lost. We're done. We're done. We're done. He lost. Done. Get out of here. Get out of here. Ooh. Ooh. What do y'all know about this free-to-play deck? We have got a Fred Flintstone deck here. We're talking about rocks and dinosaurs, and it is free to play for the most part. This deck is a little complicated, but at the same time, it's not complicated, but I'm gonna try my best to explain it. So first and foremost, we always talk about our boss card. Our boss card is not Giant Rex, but I love Giant Rex. Welcome back, Giant Rex, to Duel Links, because we haven't seen you in a while. But what's the boss card of this deck? We got two. First and foremost, Block Dragon is a boss monster and we've got Gaia Plate the Earth Giant. How does this work or what do they do? Let's talk about Block Dragon first. You can't normal summon or set it. You have to special summon it from your hand to your graveyard by banishing three earth monsters from your hand and or graveyard. Very important to understand from your hand and or graveyard. Earth monsters. Gaia, FYI, you have to special summon it by removing from play two rock type monsters from your graveyard. So if you have both a Gaia and a Block Dragon in your hand, or if you have Block Dragon in your graveyard and Gaia in your hand, based on what's in your hand, make sure you understand that Block Dragon can use both the hand and graveyard, and it can be earth monsters. Gaia has to be rock type monsters. So what does Block Dragon do outside of being fantastic with 2,500 attack, 3,000 defense? Any rock type monster you have or you control cannot be destroyed by card effects, only by battle. So you have a two part deck, discarding control, Banish and Swarm, win, 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 and boy does it win. It has beaten Onomats, it's beaten Harpies, it's beaten Thunder Dragons, it's beaten, it's beaten them all. It's beaten every single meta deck and nobody suspects that this thing is so good. We're also playing Prescience as the skill. What does Prescience do? Well, let's take a look. Prescience says you can view the top card of both players' decks until the end of the fifth turn. So we can always anticipate A, what our opponent's gonna do and B, what kind of deck type we're going up against. So we have a strategy right away and that is gonna be clutch. Giant Rex is great because when you banish this earth monster it comes right back to your field 2000 attack beater four star monster it can't attack directly but it can definitely attack monsters on your opponent's side of the field or you can use it to exceed summon a good level four blow up bald if this card is in your graveyard send the top card of your deck to the graveyard special summon this it is great to pull out a vermilion dragon mech with glow up bulb block dragon we already went over riding hand of the light sworn the light sworn engine works in discarding decks all the time and all you need are riding and charge the light brigade riding when upon summon send the top two cards from your deck to the graveyard then discards two cards why do we have charge the light brigade to send the top three cards to then add back a writing what's the point tackle crusader is the reason why tackle crusader if it's sent from the graveyard either from your hand or your deck target a face-up monster your opponent controls flip it to face down defense position it's a book of moon or you target a face-up spell a trap card your opponent controls and return it to the hand harpies hunting ground anybody we're also playing gigantis there if this card is uh, destroyed by battle and sent to the graveyard it destroys all spell and trap cards in the field it's great to go up against Odeons who set nothing but traps they they just attack in they don't read boom all the spell and trap cards or just mostly trap cards if it's Odeon get destroyed if you open a mono Wado, great if you discard it use it as banish fodder we're also playing revival golem when it's sent from the deck to the graveyard you can either special summon it in defense or add it to your hand as more discard fodder rock bombardment why has everybody been sleeping on this card rock bombardment is so good send one rock type monster from your deck to the graveyard inflict 500 points of damage to your opponent you use it to send a tackle crusader you inflict damage you flip them face down and then you win that is how this works and it is a rare card how, why is this a rare card i don't know i don't know and of course, we're ending up with Needlebug Nest. You send the top five cards from your deck to the graveyard. You mill, 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 and you've got nothing but options from your graveyard to summon some crazy, crazy, crazy monsters. You swarm, you control, you attack, you win. This deck streaks. We went on a six win streak with this deck. Then we went on a four win streak with this deck. And we just ranked up, ranked up, ranked up. This deck is so powerful. Free to play, free to play. Block Dragon is the only card that you will have to probably purchase from Guardians of Rock, but it's a mini box. And it's a super rare from a mini box. So it's so easy to grab a block dragon everything else in this deck pretty much free to play please 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 play this deck mark my words if this deck gets out there everyone is going to be playing it and winning with it it shuts down every single deck and we have the proof watch the replays enjoy and that's it 
Okay. What you discard? Ooh, oh, okay. Regular Harpist. My Activate my effect. Activates. Spin my that deck. Activates. Get another revival goal. I'm going for some defense here. Right? I special summon a we monster. can. Patriarch. Right? That's the play, right? The Patriarch. Do golem number one. Do golem number two. Now. Right? Right, 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 right. I a monster. Then we attack. Oh, we could Gaia Plate too. We could Gaia Plate too. The only problem is Hollowed Life Barrier just protected him. Hollowed Life Barrier just protected him. Okay. All right. Okay, okay, okay. We got a Block Dragon coming up. Let's hold on to it. Let's hold on to it. We could have won in that turn if he did not have a Hollowed Life Barrier. We would have won in that turn right there. Right there. Would have won. Right, what are you doing, Harpy Harpist? What are you doing? Add, adding a adding a wing beast? Go for it. Go for it. I'm gonna wait for you to egotist. I end my turn. And I'm gonna try to chain the patriarch. I'm gonna try to chain the patriarch. Big brain this. Another hollowed life barrier? Plus a lightning vortex? Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on out. Right, Harpy Channeler. Gotta destroy yourself now, that's fine. Not yet. Not yet, not yet, not yet. Not yet. Huh? Got an elegant egotist at the top there. So if I patriarch. If I patriarch now. Right? And drop a golem. And if we destroy, doesn't matter which one we destroy. We destroy. If we destroy you, oh, I'm sorry. If we destroy you and keep you there, right? That should prevent him. Or not. Or not. Or not. What's happening here? Survival golem. Again. Once per chain. Okay. Like you should not be able to special summon. That's what it says, right? He's one monster. Destroy all the monsters with that name. While this card remains up, remains face up on the field, because it's a harpy lady on the field. It's a harpy lady on the field, so you shouldn't be able to do anything. But you got that stupid hollowed life barrier, just taunting me right there. Just taunting me to protect you again for another turn. Taunting me to protect you for another turn. Ridiculous. 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 Alright, sets again. As an egotist coming up next. I end my turn. My okay, turn. okay. What what's the play? What's the play? Rock bombardment. Rock bombardment. What is the play? I set a card on the field. If we if we special summon a block dragon, can't be destroyed by card effects. That's it. But that's it, right? That's all it is. If we Gaia Plate. Oh crap. Okay. Alright, this Gaia Plate. Gigantes, you gotta You gotta go. You gotta go. You gotta go. Come on. Confirm. One. Two. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I special summon a monster. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Hollow Life Barrier. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we knew that was coming. We knew that was coming. That's fine. That's fine. I got I got something for your elegant egotist harpies. I got something for them. Although, even though you can return me to my hand, I can flip you. Hey! Thank you, Emerald Dreams, for that dono! To win in some? We're gonna win this. We're gonna win this. Alright, Harpy Channeler, do what you gotta do. Do what you gotta do. I'm fine. I'm fine. Crap. Seven seconds? Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. How did my time run out faster than theirs? Right, perfumer. Perfumer. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Stop giving. Stop. Stop counting me down. Stop counting me down. Let's let's turn it off. Let's turn it off and turn it back on when we need it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for that big old raid. Now we turn it on. Now we turn it on. Now we turn it on. Turn. 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 Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Ask me to activate. 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 Let's go. 
Taco Please Crusader. Don't. Taco Crusader. Taco Crusader. Crusader. Damage. Damage. Come on, come on, come on, come on. We gotta win. Sea of Thieves. Kill the skeleton ship. Oh, I Sea of Thieves intrigues me so much. It intrigues me so much as a game. What are we returning? What are you gonna return? What do you want to return? Thank you, because that was gonna send itself to the graveyard if I didn't do something. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Return me. Do that. I flip you. Flip, 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 flip. And then turn off. And turn off. Turn off. Woof. Running out of time. Three seconds. Three seconds to beat Harpies. Let's go. Let's go. You can't have another hollow life barrier. It can't be another hollow life barrier. So we're gonna win in the next turn. What is this? What is this? Who are you? Oracle? Okay. Okay, okay. Oh, that'll activate at the end. I'll activate at the end. Come on, we gotta win this. We gotta win this. So what we have to do... I'm gonna add back to your hand. So I... You know, I, uh, one, of my, one of my good streamer friends, uh, Lord of the Wings, he likes to play Sea of Thieves, and every time I watch him play it, it looks like a lot of fun. I love pirate-themed games. The Assassin's Creed uh, Black Flag was my favorite. I loved a lot of Assassin's Creed games. Black Flag, by far, was my favorite. By far. I end my turn. By my far. Turn. Paco, thank you for making the changes. Block Dragon. Block Dragon. Block Dragon, Block Dragon, Block Dragon. All right. Special Summon. One, two, th just those two. One and two. Okay. Come into the field. Come into the field. Don't have another Hollow Life Barrier. Oh my god, another Hollow Life Barrier. How did he rip three of them in a row like that? What do I have to do? What do I have to do to get rid of this guy? Doesn't even matter. I'm not even going to do it. I'm not even going to waste my time. Not even going to waste my time. That's ridiculous. That's ridiculous. Definitely. I, gotta get a, I have to get a better PC to play Sea of Thieves. Or if it's crossplay, PS4. What do I have to do to beat this deck? Three Hollow Life barriers in a row, man. What do I have to do to beat this deck? What do I have to do to beat this deck? This is ridiculous. On my hand, this is ridiculous. I don't understand how in the world Konami allowed them to rip into three Hollow Life barriers back to back to back. Back to back to back. All right, go ahead. You're gonna send something back to my hand. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. It does have crossplay. Nice. 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 I just feel like, almost feel like leaving this one. I'm sending, sending that one back. Okay. All right. We only have one card left anyway. I have one card. End your turn. End your turn. Block dragon. Yes. Uh, discard you. All right, now we have to win. Now we have to win. One, two, three. Let's go. One, two, three. To the field. To the field. Attack in. Attack in, attack in, attack in. Boom. Why did I attack that one like a fool? Why did I attack that one like a damn fool? I was trying to go for the Cyber Slash Harpy. What the hell, Konami? You were supposed to go for the Cyber Slash Harpy. That was a win. I, oh my god, I went for the Cyber Slash Harpy and it totally screwed me. Totally screwed me there. Totally screwed me there. Go ahead, attack him. Attack into the Gaia like a fool. Attack into the Gaia like a fool. Do it. Attack into the Gaia. Attack into the Gaia like a fool and kill yours. Oh my god. Yes, that, that right there is a ball shot to the, to the opponent. Thank you. Konami tried to screw me because I know I swiped towards the cyber slash harpy lady. I know I swiped towards it. See, that's comeuppance. That's comeuppance. No cards in my deck left, and I still won at the last second. There we go. There we go. There we go. Okay. You are Abyscorn. Mermails. Mermails. Athlete Crusader. Tackle Crusader. This is Dark Zane, all right. Um, you have to go camping. Don't worry, we do them every week, Corgi. We do them every week, sometimes twice a week. Okay. 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 Let's see. Let's see here. 
I did a chip on voice. Remember, it's turned off. It's turned off for the for the YouTube videos. I'll get I'll get a few. Don't worry, I'll give a few. Let's go. Let's activate. Let's activate. Okay. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. We'll redeem the chipmunk voice once we're done. Don't worry. Rock bombardment. Let's go. Raiden. Ooh, he's got something activatable. He's got something activatable. Right now, he probably thinks I'm Light Swarm, right? No, he doesn't. He's seen my graveyard. He's seen my graveyard. Ooh. Ooh, did we? Did we? We got a block dragon there. Block dragon there. Block dragon here. Block dragons everywhere. We could technically block dragon now. But we would have to get rid of Tackle Crusader, Block Dragon, and Gaia. We don't want to do that. We don't want to do that. We don't want to do that. We just want to attack him. It's we're attacking. Right we're protected. Kind of. Now, He's going to take it. He's going to take it. Because it's going to it's gonna help fuel his engine if he is playing Cyber Dragon. But he's got a Mermail card here, which is weird. Target one monster. So when this set card is sent to the graveyard, target one monster your opponent controls, send that to. Oh, so that's. So maybe it is Cyber Dragons and he's just trying to send me to the graveyard. Little does he know, we want to be in the graveyard. Or not. Okay, Cosmic Cyclone. Okay. Now that's his engine that's fueled. Shoot. Shoot. Continue my battle step, huh? Okay. Okay. All right. All right. All right. All right. Yeah, he might have. He may have gotten us here. My he may have gotten us here if he has. If he has. What? Offerings to the doomed. What? Because uh, he because you have your skill, so he has everything he needs. But the fool didn't realize I still get to do that. Boom! Protection. Protection. Right there. Protection right there. Thank you. Thank you. You can't draw. All you can do is cyber style, activate your cybernetic overflow, fusion summon, and just sit there. And just sit there. Because what else are you going to do? Unless you somehow have a concentrating current in your hand. Unless you have a concentrating current in your... Oh, Cyber Twin Dragon. Okay, you could do that too. <laughs> you could do that too. You could do that too. All right. Okay, okay. Monster Revolt has been illegal. All right, all right, all right. Then I played Pot of Greed. 2005. Then Brain Control. 2010. Slife on the sky. Oh, come on. Oh, God. Come on, man. Fuck you. We have the Block Dragon still. We have Gaia. We should do first. First, let's Block Dragon with what's in our hand, right? So we're going to Special Summon Block Dragon. We got a lot here. I'm not going to use Gloat Bulb for anything. I'm not going to use Gloat Bulb for anything, right? I don't need it. I don't need it. I don't need it. Let's go with Mono Owato because I'm not using you. Aqua Crusader, no, because then I'll have to flip you. And we don't want to flip you. We want to deal damage. We want to deal damage. So Block Dragon and... I guess Gloat Bulb. I guess Gloat Bulb. We got to do it. We got to do it. Block Dragon to the field. Black Dragon to the field. Gaia. Gaia is up next. One and two. Gaia is up next. Gaia is up next. Attack. He's got no protection. We just attack. Boom! All right, here we go. We're on a little win streak here. Let's get to. Let's see what we got. Let's see what we got. It wasn't the complete one. Oh, <laughs> oh man. Uh, we got the beta test. All right, so I'm going to try to teach you guys how to play this deck. This deck is all about discarding. All about discarding and trying to control. All right, so already we're going up against Automots, which I don't like. This is the first deck they want to, They want me to try to show you if this deck here can beat Automots. The number one deck in Duel Links right now. Number one deck. How, how many times am I going to have to hear this kid say, Zubababa, Gaga, Gaga, Gancho. All right. I activate my okay. Effect. Activate your monsters effect. Blue go. Mountain Butter Spy. Butter Spy. Butter Spy. What do you even do? Uh, okay. Cannot be used as a synchro I material. Okay. So you summon Utopia? Rise on up. It's the Mood Trapper deck. I got cutscene. 
Project Duel Club. Coming in with alpha, like bananas in pajamas. Let me not sing before I get a copyright strike. All right, gonna end your turn. Revival Golem, Revival Golem. He's got a Gaga Ga sister on the top of his deck for his next turn. So we gotta win in this turn. I don't even know how we can win in this turn. Uh, so okay, let's drop, let's set that. We'll set this. We will set, set, set. Let us Raiden. Activate. Come on, give me a Tackle Crusader somewhere in there. Give me a Glow Up Bulb and Tackle Crusader. Throw a Tackle Crusader in the graveyard. Oh, darn it. Memory loss. Uh, okay. Okay, okay, okay. All right. We're not worried. We're not worried because I have, an, I have, another, I have another option here. Oh, he's going to draw Gaga Ga Sister because we can see it. This is our skill of prescience. We can see every card at the top of the deck for both players for the first five turns. Okay. Battle. He's just gonna battle. Attack, really? Utopia. Really? Okay. Okay, he's just battling. All right. All right, we go for it. We go for it. No, we're gonna wait on that. We're gonna wait on that one. We're gonna draw another one. Next card at the top of our deck is another Raiden. Oof. Big oof. Uh, well, we could do this, right? We'll flip. We will tackle Crusader. All right, tackle Crusader activates its effect. Do some damage there. Target one face of monster. Flip it face down. All right, 2,000 defense. Uh, what do I have in here? Blow up bulb. Blow up bulb. We have a revival golem as well. So let's do this. We're going to block dragon. We are going to banish... Tackle Crusader, the Gigantes, because we can't use it, and the Revival Golem in our hand. Actually, no, let's not let's not banish that. Let's not banish that. Glow Up Bulb, I'm probably not going to use, but we'll use Glow Up Bulb. I don't, I don't want to waste the other Tackle Crusader just yet. You know what? No, Revival Golem. Revival Golem. Revival Golem. Get out of here. Block Dragon, you're up. You are up. You are up, because I can still summon... I can still summon the, bl the glow up bulb because we have, we do have a vermilion dragon mech, which we could use and wreck his graveyard. We could do that. We could do that. Thank you for that shout out for Project Duel Club, Project Duel Club and Duel Links Alpha. A plus people here, but it's the Automots get stomped. Me too. All right, let's, uh, no, we could vermilion dragon mech. We could, but we got 3000 defense here. Let's just attack. We attack in. Save the glow up bulb for a rainy day. Bye bye. Send all of those to the grave. He's gonna pull out the Gaga Ga sister. We're gonna flip it face down immediately. Okay, before he can do anything. Oh crap! Did he just draw a dodo -do, uh, -do, do draw? Blow up doll. No, I think I think that's done like that on purpose. <laughs> all right, go ahead. Get your Gaga Ga sister out here. Bring out this. Bring out your sister. Bring out your sister. I'm gonna take her out on a date. By right, flipping her face down. Oh my god. <laughs> That's horrible. <laughs> oh, Gaga got tagged. Oh jeez. That sounds bad. I'm gonna take your sister out on a date by flipping her face down. Oof. Do ba 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 gaga gancho coat. Well Time to play with the sister. When Gaga got sister is summoned, I can activate her effect. Yeah? No. No, Here's no, 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 no. Tackle Crusader. Tackle Crusader, so you can't use it. Get some damage in there. Get some damage. Oh, Gaga got, got, got bolts. Not going to help you right now, bro. Not going to help you right now because we're flipping you face down. We are flipping you face down. Whoops. Whoopsie daisy. You got flip. Flip, flip. What will you do, Onomots? And we have a needle bug nest coming up next. Oh crap. Oh. Okay, well he's got a cosmic cyclone, not worry. Let's draw the needle bug. Draw the needle bug, right? Drop you. I should have played. I should have played a level five, but I'm not gonna do it. Save the tackle crusader. This is just glow up bulb, right? Alright, we just attack. We attack in. Bye, sister. Say goodbye to your sister. End our turn. We could have we could have summoned Tackle Crusader, but I want to save it. I want to save it. 
He's gonna he's gonna use Cosmic Cyclone now like a fool. Boom! Cosmic Cyclone like a fool. Which just gives me the ability to flip this. Probably throw probably throw another block dragon in the graveyard so I can summon it. Yep. Block dragon in the graveyard so I can summon it. Come on in! Uh-huh. You don't special summon from the graveyard, do you? Oh, you do. What do you return? Okay. Oh, you do something from the graveyard. Okay. 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 Right, malevolent sin. Malevolent sin. Malevolent sin. Which I am not worried about. As I can, I'm surviving for a turn. Or not. Seize unit. Okay. 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 All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. We'll come right. We'll come right back. We'll come right back. And here's here's where he made the mistake. A mono Awato. A mono Awato. So now we activate blow a bolt. Right. Here we go. Here we go. Here's the play. Blow a bolt to the field. Right. Special summon Vermilion Dragon Mech. One, two. Right. Vermilion Dragon Mech. Activate your effect. Banish. Oh, I got. Look at all these options I got. Banish the bulb. Destroy the sin. No sin in this house. Just for kicks. Block dragon. Banish two block dragons and a giant Rex. Summon a block dragon. Giant Rex effects activates. Summon a giant Rex to the field. Now I got a full field of attacks, and he's got nothing in his hand. He's got nothing in his hand to protect. And just like that, Anamots get stomped. Stomped. Get out of here, Anamots.